Pop, pop, the big pop boy. Hey everybody and welcome back to The Big Pop Boy where in the last video we went through half of my booster box because I didn't want the video to be too long and God knows I'm not the fastest at opening packs in the world probably not even in the top 5 or 10 Hold on a minute, let me clean my glasses because my child was just literally jumping on my face less than 3 seconds ago who knows what damage he done, but personally I think I'm still pretty beautiful. But anyway guys, this is going to be fun. We have the second half of the booster box here for Vivid Voltage to open up. Okay, and if you guys haven't seen the first half, you want to get over there and make sure that you watch that first half of the video because it was insane. The pulls were absolutely amazing. Makes me wonder, is there anything left for this half? But there's still a few cards that are missing. And as we all know, every booster box has a set amount of certain cards. So I know there's definitely still some absolutely amazing pulls in this. So let's just, let's just give this booster box, oh, it's empty. Oh, well, that's the end of that, I suppose. And let's go through our next few packs, which I am uber excited for. Guys, as well as that, don't forget, we have our giveaway going for 4,000 subscribers. If you guys want to be in that giveaway, make sure to drop a comment below. Any comment at all will do. And I know some of you guys are cheeky, and in the last video I said that I got a load of any comment as the comment, but you know, I loved it. I really did. I thought that was kind of fun. So guys, let's get straight down to business. We're our first pack, Pikachu. Don't forget as well, subscribe like and please if you guys can share a couple of videos for me because the more you share the faster we grow and the faster we grow the faster we get to places and as you all know I love doing absolutely amazing giveaways for you guys and the more that the YouTube channel grows the more amazing giveaways I'm going to be able to do fire this has to be absolute fire. All right, let me just, let me move the packs over a little bit. Nuzzle Leaf, a Wash Energy, Churchester, Bat, Cedar, Vampy, Shupat, Puccina, Voltorb, and we got a Reverse Beldum and a Galarian Berserker. Absolutely awesome, guys. I do love Galarian Berserker and I love Galarian Meowth. I think they are awesome upgrades in Pokemon where I think Meowth deserved a new version because let's be honest Alolan Meowth kind of sucked in my opinion anyway he was a totally turbish Pokemon and in this one we have another code card for you guys so there you go I'm feeling so generous lately let's take a guess at that energy let's play let's play the game I won't say what game, but let's play the game. And I'm gonna go Psychic Energy. Oh my goodness! Amazing! So that was pretty cool. I seem to, I, even in the last video, everyone I kind of guessed, I almost got right, except for the last one. So let's see in this one if we can do it again. Anyway, louder, cool artwork on that. Wide on Stadium, Zebristic Liquor, Club of Cups. Clefairy, Whalemore, I, oh, I like the art on Whalemore. It's kind of got that real Alolan kind of vibe to it. It's really nice, looks really cool. And Hydro Pump on a basic Pokemon. Not a super powerful Hydro Pump, but still, like, he could easily do 70 damage with three water energy, so I think that's quite cool. Anyway, Tynamo, Ninkada, oh, cool. Do what, Reverse Hollow, that is pretty sweet. And we got a regular rare B drill. Once again, guys, I actually haven't, I think this is the first time I've pulled this B drill. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't believe I have them. And I have to say, the artwork is absolutely stunning again. Look at that. Look at he's coming in with that twin needle or sharp sting. I don't know what the attack is, but that looks absolutely awesome. I just love the way he's like, Ugh. an incredibly fantabulous B drill. So, we're going to go for a guess on the energy again. Um, what energy am I going to... Oh, I've done it the wrong way. Oh, well, I guess we know there's not much in this. There's a code card for you guys anyway. So, let's take a guess at this energy, guys. Give me... Let's say water. 
I feel water. Oh, electric. I was going to say electric and then I changed it to water. But you guys won't believe me even if I tell you that. But I really, really was because I was looking at Pikachu and I was like, oh, I'll go electric. And then I was like, no, I'm going to go with water. But I was wrong. Anyway, Bay, Dua, Aromatic Energy, Fanfi, Duskull, Electric, Pinko, Mudbray, oh, Duralida, Don, 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 Reverse Hollow. That's quite a nice reverse hollow. And for Air Rare, we got a cute little Wishmacot. Wishmacot's always good. Like, I like Wishmacot. Wishmacot's actually quite a cool Pokemon. And, like, you can't feel bad about Wishmacot. But our first hollow ish rare was Duraludon. And it was a reverse hollow. I haven't seen any reverse hollow Zards yet, guys. So, um, yeah, I'm a little bit disappointed by that. I was hoping that I'd get at least one Hollow Zard, a reverse Hollow Zard. And we got this. Okay, that's cool. In case you guys haven't noticed, wait, where did I put it? Yeah, I got the Zard Team Deck up there um, for Vivid Voltage. I'm actually not going to open it because I don't see the point. But yeah, at least I have it. Whoa, hold on. Wait a second. Did I? Did I already pull out the... Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Am I losing my marbles? Have I gone absolutely bananas? One, two, three, four... Maybe I already pulled out the... Oh, I'm losing it, guys. Honestly, it felt like I didn't pull it out and I pulled that out and it was Nessa. But I guess I probably... Oh yeah, I did pull it out and it was halfway open. Oh, I don't know what's going on. Maybe I didn't. Did I? Did I? I don't know. Let me know down in the comments. I guess I'll know when my wife is editing it. She'll let me know. Let's pick an energy, guys. Let's pick it. Let's pick it. I reckon it's going to be a ganja energy. No, it's not. It's a steel energy. And we have Alistair and Camerant, Nessa, Electric, Execute, Eevee, Woobat, Arakakuda. Oh, Reverse Hollow Voltorb, kind of cool. And Flareon, Flareon is always awesome in my opinion, guys. Any evolution is absolutely awesome in my opinion. So that's cool by me. However, it wasn't exactly a hollow, but you know. So let's do it, there we go, guys. Get that code into us. And let's go. So, another guess at that energy. I've been wrong twice in a row, so I gotta go right this time. Let's say fire. It would have to be the exact opposite of fire, wouldn't it? Hmm. Just my luck. But then again, I like it wet, so water is good for me. <laughs> yes, I do. Stone energy. All right. A stoned energy. I love it. Electric, guys. Have to say, cool, not the coolest, but still cool. Kakuna, da Dene, Pepe Kapika, Chewtle. Oh, I think that's the first Chewtle I've actually pulled. And once again, the artwork is beautiful, super colorful, real cartoony vibe to it. Nice summer's day. Couple of little sparkles around him, although he's not a shiny Chewtle, so he probably shouldn't have those sparkles, but he does. Execute and Chatatot. Oh, nice croaker. And we got a Gardevoir. Well, I would say that's absolutely turbish, but it's not, it's Gardevoir. So yeah, pretty, yeah, yeah. I shall say no more. And into the next one. Guys, hasn't really been super amazing, has it? I've been kind of hoping for, uh, I had to use my manpower there to open that pack because that was not working. Oh, check it out. Lovely code. Who's going to get that code? I don't know. Maybe I'll use it myself and you guys will never get it. Who knows? Who? Nah, I wouldn't do that. That would just be mean. But somebody was saying something to me about bots possibly. The dark energy, that's what I was going to say, except I got sidetracked. So someone was actually saying to me about, oh, my tank, about bots that are going around stealing all the... Um, all the code cards. I don't know if that's true. If any of you guys know, and oh, nice little reverse hollow skiddo, and <gasps> nice, super happy, super happy. Sorry, if any of you guys know anything about the bots, drop it down in the comments. Let me know. I would absolutely love to know. Oh, look at the Zapdos. Oh, so beautiful. Look at it. 
Look at it. Nice. I'm really happy with that. I know it's not a super rare card or anything, but I love Zapdos. One of the original legendary Pokemon. Fun fact for everybody. Arcanine was actually going to be the first legendary Pokemon, except they decided to change that and they didn't go with that. But for all a little bit of information for you guys, Arcanine was the original legendary. But then they went with the three legendary birds who are fantastic. Look at them. Look at them. Look at the lightning in the hollow there and the kind of like redness around. Man, stunning. I really, really like this card. It's going in there. My first hollow out of how many packs did we go through? One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six packs. Six packs, and that's my first hollow. Whew. I'll tell you, I am due a couple of e-cards, guys, because this ain't feeling right. This is not feeling right at all. Here, another code card for you handsomes and you absolutely beautiful people out there. Care cards for you. I'm so nice. Let's go with a grass energy. Ha <laughs> ha! I'm on, baby. I'm back. Did you see that? Grass. That's right. Or as we like to call them over in my side of the world, a ganja energy. That's right. Ferrero Torn, go goat, Caraliz, a Voltorb, a Rock Ruff, or a Rough Rock, whatever way you want to look at it. Talo, Yenma, whoop. Mudbray is nice and I'm so happy! Hey buddy, we got you! That's right, you! I'm talking to you! Yeah, and you, we got you! Oh, this is so cool! Mudbray, yeah, you go there. Oh, check him out. Check him out. Look at that, guys. Just look at the lightning, the discharge coming off his cheeks. His tail is up in the air. He is, maybe she is saying, take me from behind. I have moved my tail out of the way. Let's get this sneak attack on. Wow, check out Pika Pika. Oh, I really like it. Look at the eyes. Just look, look at the different colors that's actually in the eyes. They're not just like black. There's like green and red and yellow and turquoise and like all the beauty in them eyes and look so beautiful guys i really really like that i have to say our first v was a successful v thank you very much pika v oh i'm bringing you down a little further just so everybody can keep you in view pikachu v guys is a really nice card now it's not the full art so i'm really hoping that the full art will come along soon enough because the full art pikachu is kind of where we want to be let's pick an energy again let's say electric i'm going to say electric oh i'm doing it two in a row if i get three in a row i i will be like absolutely amazed tumbeak sableye do what Slugma, Bella Dum Dum, a Milkry, whoop, Ninkada, Graphic, Jurassic, Graphic. What's with like which head is the head? Like, is this head always like the smart? Like, do we have like the smart head that's always thinking forward, and is this head always full of totally shit thoughts, or what's going on? Oh no. Come on, something good. Oh, Don Fan. And also got Don Fan as my um, pre release pull in my pre release kit, which was quite cool. We had fun with that pre release kit. I don't know if any of you guys have seen the pre release video, but if you haven't, it is worth a check out because we did get some absolutely fantastic pulls in that pre release video. And like, Let's just say I was kissing myself. There's a hint in there to one of the best cards I got. I was kissing myself. I was totally kissing myself. Anyway, I'm sure you guys will get that. If you don't, then like, whoa. And we got another Coke card. That's right, Coke card for you guys. Let's do it. Let's guess that energy again. Um, what have I got so far? Okay, I'm going to go Psychic. Come on. Three in a row. Ah, oh, some fighting energy. I would have never guessed that. Charmeleon is awesome, and I love that card. I have to say, guys, 
This is probably one of my favourite artworks on a Charmeleon ever. Just the way like he's pushing whatever the hell that is out of the way. It looks like a big steel piece of bamboo, which I know it's most likely not, but it looks great. And then we got a pincher ch chin 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 in. And we got a telescopic sight, an aracuda, a sea dot dot, a pamphy, a shupa, a puccina, a chata, and fortress. Fortress is a powerhouse. Chata is not really anything that I like. Let's continue though. Let's just, let's keep it going. Let's see where we are. Let's throw that away. Another code card for you handsome dudes. Oh, wait, no, right, wrong pile. Right, so if we were going to guess the energy again, we got to find out. I'm going to go psychic again, just because I went psychic last time and it wasn't right. Let's go. Ah, oh, fire. Fire. Wire. Chuckle, Demise, Tynamo, Milkry, Galarian, Me, Me, Meow, and Chim, Chimney, Chim, Chimney, Chim, Chim, Chiru. Oh, cool. Zyger, D, 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 Yeah. That yoke. Which is like, kind of cool. I prefer to call it squishy. I think squishy sounds better. And... Oh, shed Inja. I kind of wouldn't mind getting a hollow Shed Inja, but that hasn't happened yet. Okay, Zergadurgadurgadur. That guy. I, I, I'm not even gonna, like... Look at the spelling on it. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce it. I probably should remember it, because, like, I've watched all the episodes and like for some reason I still can never remember all the names of all the 700 bazillion Pokemon that we have now. It was so much easier for the first two, three generations. Okay, right. Psychic energy again. Damn you. We got Cumarant. We got a drone, we got an Excadrill, we got a pony, we got a slug, we got a crybaby, we got a bunch of eggs. A whoop! Sable Eye. Nice. And. Oh, that's right. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Look at my card. Oh, oh yeah. It's freaking awesome. A memory capsule. Will this help me remember the names of the Pokemon? I do not think so. But as this would only be, to this day, the third gold card that I have pulled, I am super duper, de duper, de duper, duper happy. Although I was kind of hoping for a big golden monkey, but this is pretty good for me. I'm pretty happy with it. Check it out. Yeah. Yeah, oh, 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 sexual. I have to say, guys, it is a beautiful card. And as always, with the gold cards, like, I just love the, the style around it. I really, really like... Rainbow cards are cool and all, and they're great to have in your collection, but I don't like them that much. Like, don't get me wrong, I want them in my collection. But, like, just to look at and, like, to be, like, pleasing on the eyes, a bit of eye candy, you know? Like me anyway but to see the gold cards they are so much more eye candy than a rainbow card could ever be like a serious amount more that's beautiful guys I am uber de duber happy with that let's uh, uh, I'm messing up my little peekups right let's just sit that there I'm super happy with that I got a gold card I love getting gold cards because, as I said, it hasn't happened to me very, very often. So, uh, uh. I'm going to never pull plastic apart. Honestly, my 10-month-old baby has more strength than I have. It's ridiculous. He's going to beat me up when he's like four. I'm telling you. Right. Let's pick an energy psychic. Whoa, yeah, see that? If you just keep saying the same energy over and over, you will eventually be able to guess that energy. That's right, guys. I'm smart. And we got another Excadrill. Wow, another Nuzzle Leaf, another Opal. Riolu, once again, artwork is cool. Standing in that war, or you know he's working on his Aurora powers. It's just awesome. Sandile, one of my favorite art cards for this set. Whalemore, another great art. And let's go, we got Shuckle and 
Uh, magnetic trig, not hollow, but whatever. Right, let's get down to the next one. Oh, right, let's do this real quick, okay? Let's just do it, let's go. All right, there we go. Because what happens with my camera is like, after 22 minutes, it kind of just cuts off. I don't know why, and I don't know how to change it. I've tried. Fire energy, woo! We got a beauty. We got a stone energy, we got a shuckle, we got a Puccina happy Charmander, we got Chata, we got a Joltik, ah, oh, Cockney, Lucario reverse holo, oh man, I love that. That is fantastic for me. First Lucario card I've pulled, and we got Explode, I don't care about you. Check out Lucario. Damn, Lucario's nice, guys. Damn, he's nice. So pretty. So, so pretty. Wow. Okay. Getting Lucario straight into a sleeve because like, why the hell not, you know? That is beautiful. Re that is a great reverse. All right, let's get straight down to the next one. I'm really, really happy with that Lucario as well. Have to be honest, guys, there hasn't been loads of Vs so far. We have one, two, three, four, five, including the one in my hands, packs left. And so far, there hasn't been loads of these, but there has been some really cool cards like that Lucario, the Memory Capsule, the Pikachu V, the Zapdos is another fantastic one. Pick an energy. Let's pick an energy, pick an energy, pick, 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 pick dark. Okay, oh, yeah. that was steel. Oh. We got an extra louder because he's loud. Oh. Dudes, I forgot to touch that camera back on there. But anyway, as you guys already seen, the energy was not what I said. Louder, wide on stadium, Zebrastica, De Dene, Dilber, Osawa, Duskull, Ferrero Seed. Oh, nice, Ninjask. That is a cool reverse holo, guys. Check that out. The artwork on that is awesome. Like, check out the basketball. And there's like some dude creeping, checking out Ninjask's ass in there. I don't know why he's creeping on him and checking out his ass. Probably because he's a total perv. You know, you get people like that. Overall, guys, that is totally awesome. I really do like that. And... Ooh, Charizard! Nice! I'm gonna sleeve up Charizard, even though he's not a reverse hollow or a hollow in any way, shape, or form. He's still Charizard, and Charizard deserves a sleeve no matter what. There is no form or way of a Charizard not getting a sleeve. Like, Charizard should always, always be sleeved up. No matter what Charizard it is, he needs to be looked after, guys, okay? Because the Zard is the man. He's the, the most sought after card in the history of Poker Mysteries. And personally, I can't understand that. <laughs> but, you know, a Zard's a Zard, and people love him, even if I don't. Like, I do like Charizard, but he's nowhere close to my favorite. I want to see my favorite Pokemon get some love. Like, come on, where is the Gold Duck V? Or the Gold Duck GX? Where was he? Where was my pal? Where was my number one Pokemon? Just totally overlooked. Totally amazing. I'm going to shed a tear for Gold Duck, guys. <laughs> yeah, new. No. And let's go with grass. Oh, water. Oh well. We got White and Stadium, Matang, Mightyena. I think I'm doing pretty good on this set so far. With one box, I think I've got like a lot of the cards that I'm gonna need. Uh, Dusko, Electric, Pineco, Muddy. Oh, Reverse Flareon, that is absolutely fantastic, guys. A Reverse Flareon is always, always, always a good thing. Check it out. And in the next spot, we have Dancy. Dancy is also good. Um, I think I got a Dancy in the first half of the box. Um, I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that I did. I like Dancy because I like anything that's purple because purple's my color, yo. 
So that's pretty cool. We got a reverse Flareon. Actually done pretty well on rare reverse hollows in this um in this side of the box. Especially this Flareon I'm really happy with. Like who doesn't love a reverse Flareon? Any kind of Flareon. Hold on. I had to fix the chair. It wasn't clipped in right, so I actually leaned on it to push it down, and when I pushed it down, it made that noise. Just so you guys know. The one is thinking anything bad of me or anything, you know. And there's another code card for you. I'm going to give you guys the next one upside down, so you have to turn upside down in order to be able to read it. That's right. Right. One, two, three. Four. Oh my god, when I fixed that chair, it all of a sudden smells so bad in here. What the hell was that all about? Pick an energy grass. Oh, dark, darn it. Anyway, oh, Carol is. First card for Carol is. Look, she's over there in the ruins. She's got a big diglet sticking out of the ground. We got another electric. Um, that yoke, this yoke, that yoke, another yoke, happy yoke. Bally pointy yoke and reverse hollow beauty. She is, yeah, I guess she's all right looking, you know, wouldn't really be my cup of tea, but whatever. Yes, I knew it was going to be good. I could feel it. That's why I've done that whole like, pow, pow. Check that out, bay, full art. Look, look at those thunderous ties, guys. I'm telling you, she's coming in. Little bit of a girl after my own heart. Went for Taekwondo when I was younger. That's right, done a little bit of Taekwondo. Got kicked in the face quite a lot. It was fantastic. Didn't really kick many people in the face, but I got kicked a lot, so I learned how to take a kick. That's right. But check that out. I have to say, that's beautiful. She kind of scares me. Even in the card, she kind of scares me. I am a little bit scared of that girl right there. She's like a total wow powerhouse. I wouldn't mess with her. Maybe you guys would mess with her, but I wouldn't mess with her in any way, shape, or form because she's just going to mess you up. Like, look at that. Damn! She would kick seven kinds of shite out of me. I can tell by looking at her. Even if you just looked at her wrong, she would just beat you up. Maybe she wouldn't. Who knows? But she looks scary. That's all. Guys, that full art bay card is absolutely beautiful. I'm I'm glad I pulled it. Who knows? The last couple of packs have been absolutely fantastic. So let's go with our next code card. There you go, guys. Turn yourselves upside down in order to get that one. That was pretty cool. One, two, three, four. Considering we've been having great luck, let's say grass energy. Yes, yes, see, see, amazing. Right. We got a Galvantula. Hmm. Galvantula in Pokemon and Acromantula in Harry Potter. They're kind of very similar, right? Except Acromantula Venom is like incredibly rare according to one of the professors. What was his name? I don't know. The dude who helped out Valdi. You know. But there we go. A Galvantula. He looks scary. Seriously. And let's get continue. Sableye, go, go. Rolio, Sandile, Whalemore, Weedle. Dudes, I swear to God, go back like three packs from, uh, from Riolu on has been like the exact same four cards in a row. I swear to God, the Illuminati is messing with my Pokemon cards. I think it was like three or four packs ago, but it was the exact same. Why do I remember? I don't know, but I definitely do. And we got electric, that's cool, right? Nice reverse, and crocodile, regular hollow, not super rare. Last pack. I have a history of being very lucky with the last pack. Hold on, let me. Love me, love me like you do. Okay, I have spoke to the Pokemon gods. Okay, well, just the one Pokemon god. He's up there. Watching down on me. He created all other Pokemon and he said he's going to create this pack to be absolutely fabulous for me. That's right. Not for you. For me. So another upside down code because I'm a scrout and you guys have figured out oh, I should really like let you guess the last letter. Wouldn't that have been fun? 
But anyway, I didn't. So uh, let's continue, okay? So, um, guys, what have you all thought of this pack opening so far? Personally, I think it went quite well. Electric energy, that's what I said in my head. So personally, I think it went quite well. I got gold cards, full art, V, some beautiful hollows, amazing reverse hollows. I got a Charizard. Didn't get a reverse holo Charizard, which I was kind of hoping for in this box, but that never happened, so what can you do? Ferrer, Ferrer Return, a G -G Ghost, a Stoner Energy, a Galarian Mimute, a Cottony, an Artuda, a Nindada, a Picada, a Shupapa, Will we have magic? Quick, drop down in the comments down below what you guys think the last card's gonna be. I'll give you 10 seconds, okay? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Ah, it wasn't as amazing as I was hoping it would be. Oh well, still pretty cool, okay? It was a Zygerdiger, as Zygerdiger, squishy. It was a big squishy, that's right. There we go, big squishy, look at him, look at him. You got a gray one and a red one and he's blasting his balls out of his hands or whatever the hell those things are. Guys, once again, it has been an absolutely fabulous box. I was happy with what we pulled. I hope everybody else was happy with what we pulled. We got Zazard, we got some, right, Let's just go through it. Uh, first of all, I'm going to show you this because it's a Zard. It's not a reverse holo Zard or anything. It's just a regular Zard. Look at that. Regular non holo Zard. It's cool, okay? Then we are going to go on to a rare reverse holos. I'm not going to show you all the common and uncommon holos because nobody cares. I don't even care. We got a Flareon reverse holo, which was real cool. A Ninjask reverse holo. Lucario, which was probably my favorite reverse holo of them all. Look at him. Just look at him. Knuckle Impact. I've been there with more than one of my partners. Oh, yes. They've had that Knuckle Impact. And they liked it. Anyway, uh, that one, and Duraludon. Duraludon is always cool, in my opinion. Big, monster-looking, beastly guy. And then we have a that one, a Dancy and a Zapdos. Zapdos is so cool-looking. Probably my favorite holo from this pack is Zapdos, guys, because, like, just the artwork... Not even Zapdos itself, but the artwork behind Zapdos is brilliant. And for me, that's enough to make me love it. And in case you haven't been seeing these throughout the whole video, we have a cute little Pikachu V, a bay full art with her Thunder Ties, and a memory capsule. Gold card, that's right guys, got me some, a chair, a damn chair. Got me some gold, that's right. Got the gold, baby, gold. So overall, has it been a good box? Well, it's been all right. It hasn't been the best box in the world. We've had better. Um, overall, I think the box was absolutely amazing, guys. Like, really, really, really amazing. The first half was definitely better than the second half. So if you haven't seen the first half, go check that out, because that was mind-blowingly impressive. But like overall, these are our scores from the last few packs. Well, maybe not the Zard, but like we done well. I think it was cool. I'm happy with it. I hope you guys are just as happy watching how happy it made me to make you guys happy with the happiness that came in the packs of happy, happy, happy. That's right. So um, guys, let me know down in the comments your thoughts on the box. Whether, um, only let me know this though, if you've watched the first half and the second half. What did you think of the box overall? Was it really worth the money? Personally, I think it was definitely worth the money. There was a bit of a, uh, quite a lot of good cards. I think if I was to break every card down and sell them individually, 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 Individually puff, no. Individually lily, 
Yeah, there we go. That was close enough. Individually, if I was to sell them all like that, I think, personally, I would double the money that I spent on the entire box. Obviously, the bulk would be getting sold as bulk. I'd be like, wait, 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 where's the zoom on it? I'd be like, hey, you guys want to buy some bulk? Walk down to my local shop with my big trench coat on and my pedo beard and like I don't have a pedo beard but I get one just for the occasion and then walk down like with the big jacket y'all want to buy some bulk I think that would be awesome so that would be fantastic I really think that we made a little bit of money around here guys honest to god I think this worked out ever so well like if I was to sell everything I reckon the entire box would definitely be double the money ninini. It was good. It was good. Look, quick, quick flight trip. Boom, 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 boom. That's right. And as for the rares, we we got all our amazing rares in the last one, so they're not coming again. We got boom, 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 boom. Probably my favorite rare. Artwork's awesome. The Pokemon himself is awesome and he's a Perserker. So guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, I love having you all here. Without you guys, there would be no point in me doing all this. So thank you very much for giving me the time that you give me to come and watch me do stupid shit. <laughs> Let's be honest, that's pretty much all I do. Um, so yeah, yay, I love you, you just love me, woo, poker family, woo, big pop family, yay. Thanks guys, and I will see you all again soon with some more absolutely amazing videos. Bye, take care, have a wonderful, wonderful week. Energy! Oh, that was stupid. Now I gotta pick them all up.